All right, we're talking liquid courage today. Yep, that's right. Let's chat. What's up everybody, welcome back to another episode, it's your boy Jabril, and today we are going to talk uh, my top five bum brand pre-workouts. Now, before I get too far ahead, if you guys are new, make sure you hit that sub and notification button for me, throw a comment down below, share this with your friends and family, enjoy. So, this is just me talking, this is my opinion and my opinion only, this is me, myself, and I, in my kitchen, with a GoPro, okay? So, these are going to be my top five uh, pre-workouts, flavors, I guess, uh, that I have been using over the course of almost five months, possibly five months, uh, since I've been going to the gym and working out. Now, yes, pre-workout isn't the best, but I'm only using it for its intended use. I'm not using it for anything else. I'm using it before I work out, to go work out, and that's it. Now, the nice thing about this particular pre-workout is to me, it's kind of the, it's the baseline, kind of the starter pack of pre-workout stuff. The other stuff, I'm not a huge fan of. I've tried the other stuff, and the other stuff makes me too jittery. It makes me feel like my heart's gonna jump out of my throat. I don't like it. It's too much. This stuff is just, just right. It's what, I, what I'm looking for. Again, it gives me that extra little bit of boost, that extra little bit of pump to get through my workout. So let's start with the least desirable flavor, I guess. So we're going to start with number five. Now, what I'm going to rate these on is based off of flavor and its effectiveness. So whether it's lacking flavor and lacking effectiveness, or it's really good flavor and really good effectiveness, or the in-between. So that's what we're doing. So number five is unfortunately blue raspberry. Now, to me, it tastes like it tastes like the leftover stuff in a in a slushy that you get, and it's the stuff that's already mixed in with the melted water and it's already diluted. That's what it tastes like. It tastes like the leftovers. I'm not a huge fan of it. Uh, it's not what I was hoping it would taste like. I hoped it tasted like those uh, those dum dums. Those dumb dumb suckers. I was really hoping it would taste like. It does not. Uh, not a huge fan of it. Not my personal favorite. And honestly, I feel like they were trying to get the the blueberry flavor and forgot to add the pre-workout. Like it's just not very effective. And again, the flavor's not there. Uh, and then number four. Now, with this one, the only reason it's number four is because either you're gonna like it or you're not gonna like it. And when I tell you what it tastes like to me, you'll understand. Uh, the effectiveness is there. And again, the flavor is there, but I also don't know if this is just a limited time thing or if it's a one-time spiel or you can only get it online or only at certain stores, I don't know. But number four is the peach mango. Now to me, this tastes like those uh, peach tea uh, Lipton mixes or those peach tea uh, drink mixes, that's what this tastes like to me. I personally enjoy them. Some people don't. That's why if you like it, you like it. If you don't like it, well then you won't like it. Um, some of the effectiveness is there compared to the blue raspberry. Again, I think they were aiming for the flavor and forgot some of the effectiveness, but it does have it and I enjoy it. But that's number four. Number three. I don't necessarily hate it. It's just that the flavor got too much and it's a lot. Uh, it definitely tastes like what it's supposed to taste like. It is available at like Walmart and stuff like that. Like they have it just about anywhere. I didn't enjoy the flavor a whole lot because it was a lot, but at least it tasted like it did. And I will say that the effectiveness is there, but I'm putting this at number three. And we're going with the sour watermelon. Again, it definitely tastes like sour watermelon, but to me it's got more sour than it does watermelon and it gets kind of old after a while. 
but again, if you like that, this is more, more power to you. But the flavor is there and the effectiveness is there. Just not my cup of tea, just not my cup of joe, that's all. And then that leads me to my top two. So I'm gonna start with the second one and then I'll say the first one. Both of these have their flavor. Both of these have their effectiveness. Uh, both of these are great. This is just personal preference. So this is one of those like, what do I wanna try? Which, which pre-workout do I wanna try? Do I wanna try this brand? Uh, do I not? What flavor do I choose to try it first to see if I even like it? Well, this one is like the baseline. This one I think is like their popular flavor. But this one, I suggest if you do wanna try this brand, you should start with. But this one is the Fruit Burst. Basically fruit punch, tastes exactly the way it's supposed to. Definitely has its effectiveness. Did not lose that at all. Like I said, it, I think it's at Walmart, it's at a bunch of other places, but like this one's like their like their starter brand. This is like what, what kind of, this is their main flavor. Again, the same as the sour watermelon. It's like their top two big flavors. If you wanna try it out first, I suggest do this. If you wanna, if you wanna start with something, try this first. Again, I, if I could put them as a tie, I would, but personally, my number one most favorite flavor, the orange. I really, really enjoy this one. I really like this one. This one tastes the way it's supposed to. It definitely has its effectiveness. Did not lose its, its effectiveness trying to get the flavor out of it. To me, it tastes like a combination, if you've ever had Tang and, and Fanta. Like it's, it's a combination of those two. It's if Tang and Fanta had a, had a child. Like that's what this tastes like. I love it. I enjoy it. But this one, you kind of have to look for at certain stores. This one's not readily available. You gotta either buy it online or go to a, like a vitamin store or whatever, or a GNC. It's that kind of thing. Like, you gotta look for it. So that's why I say, if you're gonna start with something, start with the Fruit Burst one. But if you really want to, and you've tried them all, and you're just not a fan of all of them, but you wanna try something different, Orange, orange all the way. I love it. It's an, I, I really, really enjoy it. And it's a flavor that doesn't grow old. Same with the Fruit Burst, a flavor that doesn't grow old. I enjoy them all. There you have it. Those are my top five uh, bum raw essential pre-workouts that I enjoy. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Peace out, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.